Net Marvel has just announced Terra Origin, the latest entry into the long-spanning Terra series that includes Terra M. There are six classes in Terra Origin. Archer, a long-range attacker that quickly launches various arrows and launches powerful attacks from a distance. Fighter, an attack-type tank with a well-balanced offense and defense that uses punches and kicks as the main weapon. Lancer, a tanker becomes a shield of friends with overwhelming defense and fights using a huge spear and shield. Slayer, proximity attacker who is good at interpersonal battles that swings out a large sword and launches an attack. Alchemist, an attacker who manipulates magical magic and suffers enemies. Priest, healer that excels in recovery and auxiliary magic and supports friends from behind. Developed by Squall, an internal team of craft and formerly known as Bluehole, the new mobile MMORPG will launch for both iOS and Android devices in the Japanese market first before it goes to other regions. Terra Origin is the third mobile MMORPG based on Terra which launched exclusively in Japan a few days ago. Before this, there were Terra M and Terra Classic, with Terra Frontier still in development. Terra Origin is the only title which is launched exclusively in Japan, the other in South Korea, but it rare. LLY is a remake of Terra M by developer Netmarvel, which previously claimed it is brand new game. You see, Terra M bombed in South Korea, and Netmarvel most likely did not want the same to happen in the lucrative Japanese market. The main difference in Terra Origin compared with Terra M is the Raven feature, which is essentially a guardian pet system tied to boosting characters' elemental stats via imbuing weapons. It is somewhat similar to Eidolons in Aura Kingdom, if you played with MMORPG before. The gameplay of Terra Origin is largely automated, with the occasion swapping of Ravens to suit each area's elemental weakness. With the fourth Terra Mobile game arriving, it is definitely a surprise none has launched outside of South Korea and Japan yet. Terra Origin has a lot of events and campaigns that can make the game comfortable, and various in-game events will be held as the official server starts. Participate in the 50 vs 50 large-scale PvP, mythical battlefield, from the contents that can fight and fight with other players, which is the T-Traction of MMORPG. In addition to being rewarded for winning the game, you can earn a large amount of blue gems in-game currency by establishing or joining a guild. In addition, at the release commemorative new login event where you can get luxury items when you log in every day, you can get the highest rank, Raven, from the spirit, Raven, that can strengthen the player's ability on the seventh day you can get a gacha ticket. There will also be a release commemoration pickup gacha where Raven, Burita, who plays an active part in the tutorial, appears. Since the appearance rate of Burita is up, please get this opportunity.
私の名前わかりましたようこそです
그래야도 
Make it clear. 